For those who are wondering what Obama is doing to medicine in America, a friend sent me medical enrollment forms from the year 2016. Apparently that internet goes further than I thought. Greetings. We here at the People's Revolutionary Medical Bureau of the New America are here to help you. We are sorry to hear that you have been diagnosed with a medical condition. Please answer the following questions to help us determine if you are qualified to receive medical care under the magnanimous health care system of our beloved leader. Hmm, where have we heard that term before? Number one, did you fail to donate to the Obama campaign? Ooh, this is not starting off well. Number two, do you own guns? If yes, then allowing you access to medical care may endanger others. Or it might save lives, you knucklehead. Number three, are you willing to surrender your guns in exchange for medical care? No. Number four, have you ever opposed the right of homosexuals to have free and unrestricted access to prepubescent children in the public schools? If so, then allowing you access to medical care may be a violation of the Pelosi co political correctness laws. That woman's starting to bug me. Number five. Are you now or have you ever been a member of a subversive group such as the Tea Party, Bible-believing churches, or other group that believes the federal government should be subject to constitutional restrictions? Number six, do you watch Fox News or Joe Dan Gorman's intellectual frog legs? Well, yeah, frog legs every chance I get. If you have answered yes to two or more of these questions, please submit your request for medical care to the nearest Obamacare death panel. Please be advised that the federal determination of your eligibility to receive medical care is final and any disputes will be settled vigorously by the Janet Napolitano complaint squad of the DHS. Isn't it good to know that Obama is taking such good care of America? This is Wild Bill for America. Thank you for watching and America, bless God again.